Welcome, and thank you for joining me for today's chair yoga practice. This practice can be done anywhere where you can find a comfortable seat, in your home, at your desk, any chair or seat will do. It's best that you have a chair without arms, but if your chair does have arms, just sit a little forward and be mindful of the arms. Great, to begin, let's settle in and find a comfortable seated position. And as you sit, try and intentionally sit up a little taller, focusing on a nice straight spine. To begin, if it feels comfortable, you can invite your eyes to gently close. But if that doesn't feel comfortable today, you can just simply gaze ahead or down, focusing on nothing in particular. Land here, come into this space and this moment, letting go of what may have come before, earlier today or earlier this week. Just be present in this very moment. Maybe select an intention for yourself, something you'd like to invite more of into your life. Then begin to intentionally focus on your breath. At first, just noticing the nature of your breath. How fast or slow does your breath feel? Is your breath shallow or deep? How does the temperature of the air feel as it's coming in through your nose? No right or wrong answer. Just noticing, being like a researcher of your own experience, taking in information, noting it, and then letting it go. No judgments. And then as you notice how your breath is in this moment, begin to bring even more intention to that breath. Begin by inhaling and really filling up with air. Fill your belly, feel your chest rise, and then pause at the top after you've taken a deep inhale. After this pause, open your mouth and let it all out. Again, inhale through the nose, breathing deeply, filling belly, filling chest, pausing, and then opening your mouth and letting it out. <sighs> now, bring your intention to breathing in through the nose and out through the nose. Breathing in, filling with air, and then pause and exhaling through the nose. Again, breathing in through the nose, pausing and exhaling through the nose. This time, think about your intention, the intention that you chose to invite into your practice as you focus on your breath. So inhale, invite that intention in. And on your exhale, send that intention out to the world. Again, inhale, invite your intention in with your inhale. And on your exhale, send the intention back out. Continue to breathe in this way for a couple breaths. Again, focusing on your intention. And then as you're ready, you can blink your eyes open and we'll start to connect some movement with our breath. So from your tall seat, begin to lift your arms up 
on your inhale, inhaling up. And your exhale brings your hands to heart center. Again, inhale to lift up, arms rising. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale to bring our arms up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Two more this way. Inhale, rising up. Exhale, heart center. Inhale, rising. Exhale, heart center. This time, inhale your arms up. And then when you're at the top, twist to your right, bringing your left hand to your right knee and your right hand can grab the chair behind you or prop up just up behind your back. So you can hold onto the chair or just use it as a prop behind you. Coming into this twist and as you inhale, think about lengthening the spine and growing tall. And as you exhale, think about coming further into your twist. If it feels comfortable, you might invite your eyes to look over your back shoulder. But if this feels like too much of a twist today, just have your head forward. Again, as you inhale, lifting tall. And as you exhale, coming further into the twist. Inhale to lengthen and exhale to focus on your twist. Inhale to lengthen and exhale to twist. Then on your next inhale, you will bring your arms back up to center, reaching tall and then twisting to your other side. So right hand comes to left knee, left hand, hand comes to grab your chair or prop you up right behind your back. And again, inhale to lengthen, reach tall, and exhale, focus on the twist. And as before, you can invite your eyes to look over that back shoulder or if that feels like too much of a twist, just keep your head forward. As you inhale, focus on lengthening, nice tall spine. As you exhale, focusing on the twist. Inhale to lengthen, exhale to twist. Then on your next inhale, arms rise up again, meet in the center, and then release. From here, we'll do our eagle arms. So nice stretch of the shoulders. So begin by inhaling your arms up, and then your exhale brings your right arm under the left, and then you have a few options here. You can bring back of your palm to back of your palm, you can come into a full twist, or you can come into a nice hug position. Another option is to bring elbow to elbow and palm to palm. Again, right arm under left, back of palm to back of palm, twisty or hug position. And in this position, Think about lifting up your el elbows and bringing your shoulders back and down. So you don't want your shoulders up in your ears. You wanna make sure they're coming back and down, down your back. And also focusing on lifting the elbows up so they're about shoulder height. And while you're doing this, making sure to stay connected to breath. Your inhale and your exhale. Then your next inhale brings both arms up, reaching tall, 
and then other side. So left arm comes under, maybe you come to hug, back of palm to back of palm, twist, or again, elbow to elbow, palm to palm. Wherever you land, again, focusing on lifting elbows and shoulders coming back and down. And this is actually a great form you can take throughout your day, particularly if you've been sitting at a computer or desk and doing work. It's a nice way to open up the shoulders. So we get really tight and hold a lot of stress in our shoulders. Great. Then on your next inhale, arms up, reaching tall, and then release. Now from here, we'll do a little bit for our lower body. So we'll do a seated pigeon pose. So what you can do here is to lift up your foot and land your ankle onto your thigh. So start with one side, it doesn't matter which, but bringing your ankle up onto your thigh. Again, seated nice and tall, make sure you're Spine is nice and long. And if you feel a little extra opening, you can just take the palm of your hand and kind of give a push into your leg. Again, as throughout our practice, staying connected to your breath. And then releasing, bringing it to the other side. So bringing ankle to thigh, maybe giving a little push into your thigh just to open up. Sitting nice and tall, connecting to breath. Then landing your foot back down. Maybe stretching one knee up into your body. Holding that there. And then releasing. And then the other side. And releasing. And then maybe taking a nice body stretch to close our practice. So inhaling arms up and then folding forward over your body, dropping your head down. Your hands can be on your chair, on your thighs or on the floor. Just let your head hang down for a moment. Staying connected to breath and noticing how your breath might be more constricted here as you're folded over. And then when you're ready, bringing palms to your thighs if they're not already there and then lifting back up to seated. And we'll close our practice with two deep breaths. You can bring your hands to heart center or perhaps fold it onto your heart. You could always leave them right on your thighs. And together, let's take a deep breath in, pausing, and then breathing out through the nose. And one more inhale, breathing in deeply. pausing and letting it out. Thank you for your presence here today and joining me in this practice. Be well.